Hey, what's up guys, Captain Zach here. Well, it is mid-September and the cohos are safe. So we have uh, put away the salmon trolling gear and in these last few outings of the season, I think we're gonna target some Hallies. So that's what we're doing today. We're doing some just drifting and back trolling across some shallower spots today. I've got the GoPro down there as well, so maybe we'll get some cool footage, but uh, it should set up pretty nicely. It's a favorable day, nice, bright and sunny, and we're just approaching a, a low tide. The tides are pretty big right now, so there's a lot of water moving, so we're hoping that when that water's moving across these shallow flats that the, uh, the halibut will be, be right there to find our jigs. I got the seven ounce fire eye flutter bug all loaded up with a couple of pieces of herring and some squid to keep that on. Plenty of hook clearance there. That ought to get them. You on? Oh yeah. How's it feel? Sweet. That didn't take long. Yeah. It almost feels like an uh, You want me to uh, pull up or stay down? Oh, hold on now, I'm getting a bite. Here we go. Oh geez. <laughs> okay, we got bites on both sides. This is getting out of control. Oh, oh my gosh. Uh, no, I've missed it twice. <laughs> there we go. Oh yeah, fish on. Oh yeah. Okay, let's this one Oh geez. <laughs> Mary's slinging them in the boat. And I've got one on too. Nice, some immediate action here. Wow. Okay. Probably about five minutes of, uh, probably not even five minutes of soaking the jigs. And an immediate double. Boom. Okay, there's one chicken heading back. That's on the fire eye flutter bug. Oh, bam, a chicken double, the first cast of the day. <laughs> I definitely keep missing them. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to make excuses today. No excuses about how the feel of this rig severely limits my ability to optimally time a halibut hook set. Miss. Unbelievable. Wow. Fish up. I guess sculping <laughs> with his mouth open. Nice hook set. Thanks. All right, it's a chicken howie that's foul hooked. <laughs> okay. Well, if that's the size halibut. <laughs> That's the size halibut that's messing with us. No wonder we're swinging and missing a lot. Speak for yourself. Oops. Quick release. Still high potential here, I think. Yeah, no reason to believe there couldn't be a, you know, 80 pounder just working its way through there. Oh. Uh, compromised, compromised hook set. <laughs> Of course. I dropped it right back down. Look at that. Can you see my bait? Look at that. A monster halibut almost just pulled Mary out of the boat into the water. Okay. Come on over to mine now. Nope. Fish on. No way! <laughs> Got him! No! <laughs> I caught Mary's fish. <laughs> Although, actually, I shouldn't count my chickens before they're <laughs> yeah. in on the, the boat. boat. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, halibut usually hang around. They're, they'll keep striking at it. They'll keep getting more and more aggressive. Can you get one? Yeah, kind of a cool, cool looking fish. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, a little nicer chicken there. Awesome, he just hammered it. Right after uh, right after it hammered Mary's and missed, <laughs> then it couldn't resist mine. 
That's hilarious. This chunk of squid just popped out of its mouth. That is what was on Mary's line. So that is definitely the, uh, the same culprit. Oh, well, it's his lucky day. I think we're going to uh, only keep some nicer size fish. So he's heading back. You on? You on? Yeah. Sweet. But I don't think it's a howler. Actually, hold on. I was getting a bite. Although we're drifting a little, little yeah, aggressively here, so that makes me want to get the kicker on a little bit. Oh, hold on. Oh, here it is. Hold on one second. What is it? Oh, I keep missing them. Um, sweet, Mary with another nice little chicken. Oh, and Mary is hooked up again. Bang, another nice little Howie. We're on a tear today. <laughs> Oh, that's cool, a uh, puffin just floated by. So Mary's taking some pictures of it. It's pretty neat. It's probably about maybe 50, 50 yards or so away. Fish on. Feels like a little chicken halibut. Feel the thump, 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 thump. Right at a hundred feet, right on the nose. Actually, got a little bit of foul hook, but it'll play. Nice little chicken. I think we'll send him back. Nice. Fish on. <laughs> <laughs> Who's winning this battle? Oh, no, no, no. I see him lose the dragon. Okay. <laughs> Fish on in an exciting uh, <laughs> fashion. Jeez. Feel like a decent one? I mean, better than those. Yeah. <laughs> no, here, let me pull up. No, 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 you're fine. If it starts running that way, I'll tell you. Okay, let me get the gas. Lost my wife to a halibut. <laughs> Started pulling her over the side. I can't even sit like that. <laughs> trying to open. Nice. I'm trying to open with the basket. <laughs> <laughs> Watch just this tiny little. Yeah, it'll be a, a four pounder instead of a three pounder. <laughs> Tight. I'm trying to take my good, good head thumbs there. I'm trying to take my best off. Mm -hmm. oh, oh. That can wait for. I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> there we go. Oh, that's good. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. We're only in one. We're 115. So I can see it coming up on the sonar actually. Are you okay? Oh. Yeah. Just, just keep it, keep it tight. Yeah, you're like 30, 35 feet. Okay. Oh, I see it. You see it? Yeah, I got a little bit of color. Okay, yeah, he's a little. We'll try to put him in the boat. Which way? He's, uh, he's. There, little trade spots. There you go. Bring him right around. Boom! <laughs> oh, and Mary won the battle. Well, the fish almost pulled her in, but we ended up getting this nice 25 or 30 pounder. What a great fish. fish. You get it? No, Dang I didn't. It. <laughs> My drag was nice and loose from the last time I had it in the rod holder. Oh, great. 
<laughs> Darn, I think that was a nicer fish. Here we go. Come on, bear. Fish on. Nice. Pretty, little better one. Tell me if you need me to go uh, okay. Yeah, I'm just debating. Yeah, maybe reel up. Because okay. I might need you. I might need your help landing it. And I'm certainly not gonna. I'm not gonna muscle this fish in. Oh, good. Yeah. I I don't want it to go to that rock pile with my GoPro attached. Finally, we wade through those chickens. Mary got a nice one. Now I'm hooked up with something that's a little bit better. I actually missed it the first time. Dropped it right back down. Okay, here we go. What do you want me to do? Uh, I need I'm just going to see you right. Uh, I'll probably do. Oh. Uh, not bad, another decent chicken. Fish on. Nice. Can we hold? Uh, yeah, I'll hold. This probably isn't that big. Oh. Well, once you see color, let me know. Okay. Still, that hit it, like right as it, right as it hit the bottom. Good. Not bad, little chicken. I'll just grab the chain and you want to pick this up? Yep. Got it. Oh, quick release. <laughs> Sweet. I just sent him right back. Fish, fish on, but this feels small. Yeah, definitely smaller than that last one that I quick released. I don't know. Uh, yeah, actually, I can see it. It looks like a small halibut. <laughs> Very small. <laughs> that is a chicken nugget. have a fish on. I don't know if it was your fish. It's not a big fish though, so not getting much head thumpage here. I shouldn't jinx it. We've only caught halibut today. We've had no bycatch, except now, which is a snagged flounder. Well, there you go. Oh, I've said before on some underwater footage that these uh, these little flounder have no shot at eating this jig. Check out that hook size and then this tiny little mouth. Almost no way. It's really hard to hook those uh, normally, but they'll often swipe at it. So it's not uncommon to, uh, to snag them when they're grabbing for the bait. That razor sharp hook, uh, sometimes it gets them. Oh my gosh. Um, these are probably like rockfish or something. Well, you'd be catching them if they were rockfish. Fish on. That's a howie. Nice. See, all I had to do was accuse it of being a rockfish. And the halibut said, I'm not going to stand for that. 105 feet. Hey, hey, another chicken halibut. Oh my gosh. Don't, please don't get fooled on me. <laughs> Is that a halibut? Yeah, it looks like a halibut. This is, this is something else. Yeah. 
There you go. <laughs> Perfect form. <laughs> I do. Sweet. There you go. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Bam! There you go. Well, how about that? I guess we should call that a halibut double. I just tossed one back and Mary hooked up right as I did. <laughs> nice fish. And I guess it, technically it is noon right now. Okay. So we're gonna, we might have to call a little bit of a, maybe 12, 15. 15 more minutes. You on? Oh, I'm getting bit too. Yeah. Your your line's going nuts. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Yeah, me too. I wonder if you have. I wonder if you snagged mine. No. Mine's coming up. Yeah, I think you're bringing mine up. Thanks for bringing mine up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, wow, this is quite a hit. It just grabbed it. And it's running right to the top. You got a halibut and my rig. And I do have your rig. Oh, well, I think we're getting ready to wrap it up here, but what an awesome session. So we're fishing for probably maybe three, three and a half hours or so, and just nonstop action, really. Like the, the double right off the bat, and then we just never look back. I'd say we didn't go, you know, five, 10 minutes without some kind of bite or, or catching one. We probably caught probably a dozen or more. I don't know, maybe 15 or so halibut. So we released a bunch of little chickens and uh, we put two in the box. So some nice little eaters. So we're really pumped about that. But, but just an awesome day, like a real bonus towards the end of the season. Sometimes the weather chops up at the end of the season around September and Juneau, but uh, not today. Just a nice flat day, sun shining and the halibut are biting our jig. So all in all, good stuff. Just doing some, uh, some back trolling and drifting for, uh, for Hallies, some shallow spots here near Juneau, Alaska. Uh, and just to give you a sense of uh, the depth range we were fishing today, it was probably like in the shallowest, maybe about 75 or so, down to about 140. That's really where we were catching the fish, uh, intentionally so. So we were trying to target some shallower water today. Um, I'm sure we could have done some damage in deeper water too, but we sometimes we really like fishing the shallower flats. It makes it a little easier to reel it up. You're not as deep. Plus, uh, when I'm running my GoPro, I get much better footage in a little bit shallower, uh, shallower water. So all in all, that was just the perfect depth range for us today. Okay, this is ridiculous. I just put this away because we were just leaving and Mary hooked up, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Got a gaff. Should I have a gaff or maybe just... Oh. Looks like it's pulling pretty good. Yeah, I mean... You wanna... Come in uh, ship side. <laughs> What's that mean? You want to hop in here? Oh no. Oh, do I want to hop yeah, in there? Oh yeah. no. Oh good. Oh my gosh, 285. So I just talked about the shallow spot we were fishing. Sorry. Loosen it up. Yep. <laughs> so we dropped off of the shallow spot down to a uh, down kind of a deep ridge. So my GoPro wasn't gonna work in two or 300 feet, so I picked that up. And of course, Mary stayed down and caught a fish. Never give up. <laughs> <laughs> That's what help us. Okay, you're right in me, get in the ship here. You take okay. that. It's all. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ah. <laughs> I'm coming in. Okay, we're, we're tag teaming. Okay. <laughs> Sweet. You want it back? Why don't I hand it back to you so I can I can finish it? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's like nice and easy. Ow. Okay, there we go. That's the second oh, there time. There it is. There it is. The second time you almost got through it. Uh, no. I'll take it. Oh, well, in the final minute, Mary adds one more to the pile. Nice Hallie. Uh, check out this bite out of him. It looks like a sea lion or something. Really got a chunk of him. Let me, uh... Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Captain's Cleanup and I've got a great cleanup for you today. A nice 25 to 30 pound Hallie and a couple other chickens. Check it out. 